Hi, my name is Michelle Petrucci and I am starting the 90 day inner glow transformation program. Right now, I feel like I have been limiting my potential in all areas of my life. The thing that I am most afraid of is staying the same. The thing that I'm most excited for is taking my life to the next level during the next 90 days. So I am excited to reveal the best version of myself. You know, people just think juice feasting is like, oh, you know, I'm gonna lose some weight. And like, no, it is a spiritual practice. When you do it as a spiritual practice, it's like, right. you know, it will, it will release the resistance in your life so that you go do the thing that you've been holding yourself back from doing. And I was and you, so afraid to do the juicing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> because I thought, right? I, because I listened to what other people have done and they're like, oh, you're gonna, you're gonna be like so moody, you're gonna pass out, you're not gonna be able to make it through the day, you're gonna wind up eating. And I'm like, no, hers is different. There's something different with this. Yeah. And it was, it was so different. Now people are asking me, how did you do it? And I'm like, I'm not, I can send you to Christine and she can show you how to do it. Yes. So what I would love for you to share is let, I would love for you to let the world know who is Michelle before this transformation? I think alone, lost, looking for purpose, looking for high validation. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. I, I felt so drawn to Miami. And what this woman said the other night was, Miami was your waiting room mm. to prepare you, to prepare you for something bigger and something better. And I, I feel it now. And when I look back on it, I see it. I see everything that has been preparing me for this moment. Mm. And all the right people have come into my life mm -hmm. and you have, you have helped accelerate my healing over the past 90 days. Mm. And I've gained the courage to be able to make these steps and changes. You're amazing. And what do you think was some of the bigger shifts for you? Like, you know, somebody, this is the thing is I feel like everybody's story inspires somebody else. You know, my journey may have inspired you. Your journey exactly. is going to inspire others. Like, you know, you said there's these people that watched you saying like, oh, but it's going to be this, this. There's so many negative naysayers. There's so many people that have so much resistance in their life that they're scared to do this inner work. What was different for you or what would you say to those people, you know, that what, what, what made you ready? Listening to people that have done it. Mm -hmm not listening to the negative because the negative is going to keep you in the same place when i listen to people that speak positive words i see how speaking the positive words changes everything in your life yes and it, it made me just look back on the other things i've done in my life and when i've stayed positive and taken action yeah. everything fell into place mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And what do you feel like was different about this program or that gave you a deeper, a deeper experience um, in your accelerated healing? What, what processes was really powerful for you? I, I think each thing led into something deeper. Everything you did, it was just like we did the juice feast thing, which helped start to clear stuff out. And then it was uh, just doing and watching the videos each morning and listening to like Bob Proctor and about abundance and Abraham Hicks and it just reprogramming my mind. Yeah, I love what you said, reprogramming your mind and um, and and stepping into action, which so many people wait 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 years. I mean, do you think without this program, you would have been able to leave your job and make this move like you, or how long do you think you would have waited? In I would have been able to do it, but I would have waited a lot. It would have taken longer. This yeah. helped me do it faster. 